Welcome to Toffee TV. This video was taken from the Daily Extra, the video where we delve behind the headlines on the Everton News Daily. To watch the full video, get over to patreon.com forward slash Toffee TV EFC. We've got 10 exclusive videos on there every single week for our Patreon subscribers. So get over there and see what we're doing. George Horrocks says, how much would you sell Ghana for? Who would you bring in as a replacement? 35 million and Ibrahim Shangari. Okay. Valhalla Vikings says, how much do you think we can generate from sales? Vlasic on Yakuru, Adamola Luchman would be near 55 to 60, which is a good offset for us to go and make signings for some, with some financial freedom. Yeah, agreed. Well, we got Woff. What do we get? 15 for Vlasic, wasn't it? Mm. 23, 24 for, uh, for Luckman. So that's what, 40? On your Kuru, on your Kuru, 12, about, wouldn't he? I think it'd be more. Okay. And we're trying to get more for him. So if you got 15, we should be trying to get 20 million for On Kuru. There shouldn't be any reason why we couldn't. Yeah. But that would, you're right, that'd be 50, 60 million pounds. So that'd be decent coming in. Obviously, there's James McCarthy in there as well, I think. We'll sell. So. Coming in, Toffee says Luckman was a Steve Walsh signing. Initial fee around seven and a half million. Good return. Here we go to twenty. Same with Ghana, bought for seven million. Mm. Yeah, because I mean Luckman, it was yeah seven and a half rising to eleven, wasn't it? But he hasn't, mm. he hasn't it hardly any of those markers. So yeah, you're right, Mark. G Holderness says, "All right, lads, what would you do with Joe Williams?" Um, have a good look at him. I'd play him in. Most games mm. in these these pre, this preseason, see what he's got. He seems to have a little bit of barum, but that was against the Kenyan side. Let's see what he. No, no what no, I mean no. is it's the first game, so let's see what he's like and what he's like when he's with his first team players. More importantly, can he knit together with mm. them? Because he, he, you know, he did he did a decent job the other day. He's he, you know he's physically a good size as well. So I don't know squad player maybe. Definitely. Um, Simon Rouse says, "Evening, lads." Mm. <laughs> I love the fact that you, I got. I get the feeling with the amount of players going on loan, we're about to sign someone. I think what it is is, I think they just don't want to pay the airfares. Si. I think uh, I'm going to mention Kane in a minute, but it's like that. Like, this is now the week to sort the week from the chaff, isn't it? Who's going where? Who's going out the club? Who's going with the first team? Who's going with the under 23s? This is now the time to get that sorted and that allows spaces in for players to come into the club. Everyone needs to know where they're going to be going into the, the, the pre season. Um, Carson says, Love the new set and what's your favourite Everton game in the last three years? Oh, the Man United, Man United last, game last season because, yeah. because of the result, but also because the way we played. Sorry, I'm not being ignorant. I'm trying to sort out taking me lads of footy, so I'm going to have to run in a minute. But secondly, I was just seeing if Everton had listed who's travel to Switzerland. Kevin I know, Morales. I Morales is Kevin Morales is gone. So, you know, the other day when you were all jumping on. These weren't. These weren't. Oh, no. These are the pages. Yeah, you weren't, sorry. These weren't. All over Twitter, the, the RITKs he'd sold and all. Kane says... Matches. Couldn't agree more with me on the Sion preview that the likes of Nias going to the under 23 to train and home be with the first team. We should we should be sending players who haven't got a future with us with us with the under 23s and sending a few kids to Switzerland. Well, I, I agreed with you, but I also said we've got an obligation to those players who are under contract to get them fit. And that's Kane, my Morales. Kane, you need to convince Baz to come on the coach to Switzerland with me. He won't have it. 